Hare Krishna everyone, I am Ajay Prashar from Mass Lover. Today I am going to discuss one important shortcut of arithmetic progression which is very useful in competitive exam and also in your board exam. To get more shortcuts, tricks and tips, please subscribe my channel. Let's start. In an AP, if 11th term is 7 and 7th term is 11, then what is 18th term? In the second question, if the third term is 8 and 8th term is 3, then what is 20th term? In the same way, in the third question, if mth term of an AP is n and nth term of an AP is m, then what is m plus nth term? In the same way, the last question. Now, if you observe carefully, look here, here is 11 and here is 7. You feel, you observe some pattern here, here is 7, here is 11, mean the Numbers are interchanging. The same way numbers are interchanging here. 8 and 3, M, N and N, M. And same way 121, 238, 238, 121. In such question, the trick is that if Pth term is Q and Qth term is P, then Rth term then rth term is always p plus q minus r. Then the rth term is always p plus q minus r. Now look here. Here is the answer is 7 plus 11 minus 18. So 18 minus 18 this gives us 0. The same way here 8 plus 3 minus 20 which gives you minus 9. Now let's try here. Here ms term is n and ns term is m then m plus n that is m plus n here is we add them minus m plus n that gives us also 0 and try it yourself. Do it yourself. Thank you. Hare Krishna.